to all Patreons and uh, channel members for uh, supporting me. Uh, I'll be releasing project files to my Patreons and uh, exclusive tutorials for uh, channel members. For details, please check link in description. Thank you. Hello everyone, uh, this is Mr. Bus. Welcome back to my channel. So in this video, we'll continue further uh, on our drone AI. Uh, so uh, uh, in previous video, we saw about uh, how the drone can damage the player. Uh, now let's continue further uh, we will see about how uh, the player can damage the drone so for now uh, if you pick the weapon and fire at the drone so nothing happens the drone doesn't react okay so let's do that now Okay. First, we have already created the damage interface. If you have follow, follow, followed the series, so let's uh, import that damage interface, and let's call the event. Okay, first let me compile and damage. Okay and promote this to a variable okay Then on damage type do a switch so uh, mostly uh, the uh, the drone will have uh, either a point hit or an explosion so uh, let's do a report damage event and the damaged actor is self and instigator is the player ref so this is to alert, alert uh, the uh, AI when it's being hit get the local damage yeah. and then uh, do a branch Okay, to create a variable for the drone health. So this should be an integer and uh, let this be a float. It's not required to be a float, but let's give it an upload. So if this is greater than 20, the reason uh, we are checking if it is greater than 20 years if it is less than 20 then we'll uh, add a uh, uh, we, we will enable uh, physics on that play uh, on the on the drone character and uh, we can make it you know behave rogue when it is less than 20 so if it is greater than 20 add a, uh, drone health. set the drone health to drone health minus uh, the local damage that we are getting as input here so that we will set on the weapon so local damage and set it as the current drone health and if it is greater than 40 true Okay, do a sequence here and if it is true uh, get the chase set the chase status to being hit and do a delay random float in range Point one to point nine 
and if get the a state switch between the states if it is uh, if the a state is still under chase then add set the chase state also to chase so the reason is uh, if it is in patrol which means that uh, once it's being hit if the player goes and hides somewhere uh, then the ai ma the drone might go to the patrol state and if it is in patrol state the chase state shouldn't get changed uh, if it is still in chase then the chase state also should be in chase so uh, from being hit it uh, we are changing to chase so that's the logic here and uh, uh, on the sequence do a branch again and uh, check if it is less than 50 so if the drone is uh, damaged uh, to 50 percent then we will add a particle so before that okay, add a particle and uh, name it as general particle and put it on the mesh so get the general particle here and set template to smoke uh, to get the smoke particle uh, add it from the starter content add it to the project so we have got the starter content now now if you search for uh, smoke you get p underscore smoke okay so create a custom event and enable name it as enable physics so this we will call uh, when when uh, the drone health goes less than 20 enable for six and uh, even when we when it is hit by an explosion because that's uh, that damage will be higher so even in that case okay so now, now let's see uh, if we are uh, what what things we need to test here is uh, if uh, it is less than 50 then uh, we have to uh, we'll be able to see the smoke uh, but before that go to your uh, weapon base your weapon base uh, in uh, make damage event okay. uh, character tag we need to add uh, so Go to game files blueprints enum character tag here add drone and i think on the drone base we have already added uh, the tag so let's check that tag okay we haven't added the tag so add drone here okay now on the weapon base click on get actor tag so do a branch here control d to duplicate so here set it to drone and get actor hashtag okay. uh, drone here and on the uh, make damage event just duplicate this and uh, connect it to drone 
so the values I'm setting is almost uh, similar just for testing purposes I'm setting it as uh, 20 and okay pulse value I'll connect the same and the hit location is also the same and bone name is not required damage type is pointed okay uh, let's see mm, there is a mirror yeah local hit actor okay now let's pick the weapon and try firing So for checking, let me uh, print the damage value. Okay, I think the drone health, I have it initialized. So the drone health will set it to 100. Yeah, now we are getting the smoke effect. Okay, so it's stopping at 20. So at, uh, at 20, uh, we have to enable physics and uh, the drone will uh, start rolling over and fall. So that we will see it in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.